This is MSJ Chem. In this video, I'll be looking at N type and P type semiconductors. As we saw in a previous video, silicon is a semiconductor material with low electrical conductivity that increases with increasing temperature. The electrical conductivity of silicon can be increased in a process known as doping. Doping involves mixing a small amount of impurity into the silicon lattice. In N-type doping, group 15 elements, such as phosphorus or arsenic, are added to the silicon lattice in small quantities. In P-type doping, group 13 elements, such as boron or gallium, are added. First we look in more detail at N-type doping. In N-type doping, the addition of group 15 elements, such as phosphorus or arsenic, provide extra electrons in the silicon lattice. In this diagram on the left, we can see the silicon atoms with their blue nuclei and the one phosphorus atom with a nucleus colored in red. The phosphorus atom with its five valence electrons adds an extra electron to the silicon lattice. Here we can see the extra electron which is provided by the phosphorus atom. This electron is free to move within the silicon lattice, increasing the electrical conductivity. Next we look at P-type doping. In P-type doping, the addition of group 13 elements, such as boron or gallium, create extra holes in the silicon lattice. In this diagram, we have the silicon atoms with their blue nuclei, and we have one atom of boron with a nucleus that's colored in green. The boron atom with its three valence electrons creates holes in the silicon lattice. So here we can see the hole that is created by the addition of an atom of boron. These extra holes increase the electrical conductivity of the silicon. 